Okay, this is the Mini Ferrite Slayer Excited. This is a 9cm version, and I stumbled on something today which I hope you find interesting. And this may even work with dual feeds and other circuits, what I'm going to show you now. But uh, this is the uh, circuit running away there. Nothing else on this breadboard's involved, just a little circuit here. But we've got a really bright LED there. And uh, the circuit's running on a 1.5 volt battery, but the battery's dead. And uh, there's 352 millivolts in the battery, so we've got a really bright LED, which is that's surprising in itself. But what I did today was I swapped the battery out for this super cap here, and that had 0.3 volts in it. And uh, the circuit didn't fire up, but I wouldn't expect it to because it needs at least 550 millivolts to fire up the circuit. And uh, it's what I did then was I switched this switch on over here from a mobile phone charger, and I hit this one here next to it for the uh, adapter, and the circuit fired up. Now, is what happened was it must have sent uh, an electromagnetic pulse through the air, and that triggered the transistor. So that got me thinking, and uh, I thought of another way to start it. And uh, so what I did was, I got one of these things here. It's one of these piezoelectric uh, gas igniters. And uh, it makes quite an interesting spark, and that's an experiment in itself, I think. But uh, I can actually show you that working now. So if I just switch the circuit off, I'll just remove the negative and then reconnect it. And uh, the circuit's not working. So if you hold this gas igniter you know, in the vicinity of the L1 coil, and uh, click it, it's fired up. So this basically means we can squeeze the last drop of energy out of a battery. Uh, so if you find a dead battery which has got less than 0 0.6 volts in it, you can uh, just uh, do this, put it on the circuit like this. It may even work with a dual feed, I've not tested that. And then uh, click it with your igniter, and it starts right up. But uh, I found that very interesting. Okay, thanks for watching.